cracking first half from your side and then just ran out of steam in the end? Is that a fair way to describe it? Um, well, we ran out of steam very early. I, I felt even before uh, Hereford scored in that second half, the first 10 minutes of the second half had, uh, had been really poor and we could see the warning signs, but we just weren't able to, uh, to get out of that. And then when the goal went in, um, you know, it's, it's been a pro it was a problem at Farnborough, an early goal. This time, ten minutes at farm four minutes. But uh, but to be fair, we never never played the, the whole of the second half until the last five minutes of the game. It's over then. It's easy to play then. But as I've just said, I could have looked at all of them. It was really poor second half team performance. Um, if they're not fit enough, well, you know we have we have tried to increase the intensity, and we've had to do that because the intensity was way too low. But uh, that second half is nowhere near good enough, obviously. You could see that intensity in the first half from, the, from your players. Just as you mentioned, and fitness a big thing today. Yeah, yeah, I, I think fitness is a thing, but I, I think there was more to it than that. I think uh, I think mentally strong as well, um, because we seem to capsize if a goal got, does go in, uh, and also people taking responsibility on the pitch as well. Um, as I've just said to him in there, I said in the first half when we were clearing our lines, we were clearing it 35, 40 yards. Whereas in the second half, we weren't clearing it more than 10, 10 yards straight into their midfield. Now, unless we put on an extra stone at half time, then why is that? Is it fitness? Because if we're, if we're blowing up after 45 minutes, I'm going to have to seriously think about uh, about how we uh, how we go about the you know how we go about playing and whether we we have to adopt something different i like a high energy game but uh, the second halves in, at farnborough and dorchester and here at hereford have been uh, i've been worried long chat as you said with your players out on the pitch post match still very much for you about getting your ideas across to this side like you said there you you like to play with a high intensity yeah i think i think on the whole i have got the ideas across uh, i think they know what we're trying to do but it's whether we can do it. It's whether we can do it. And we did it quite well first half without being brilliant. We didn't create loads or, or anything. It weren't like we were playing stellar football or whatever, but we had a good organisation and a good tempo and a good energy to our game. And what, what worries you is where that energy went at half time. For people just looking at the scoreline, Steve, how much should they read into that scoreline today? In terms of but they can read into it what, whatever they want. At the end of the day, Hereford deserved to win. They scored four goals in the second half and had six or seven chances. Uh, and although we, you know, we, we, we played quite well first half, and I, th I felt we had a second goal which shouldn't have been disallowed. But, but I can't stand here and say even if that had gone in, that we'd have definitely won the game after what's happened at Farnborough and uh, and what happened in the second half today. But I felt that it was a the goalie made a jump and went over the top of a player, there was no foul and, and it should have been allowed. But I'm not using that as an excuse because uh, we went in 1-0 at half time and it was the second half that has, that has killed us. Go on a couple of new players this week as well, Aaron Rodriguez from Weymouth and uh, Matty Cater from Gospel, just talk us through well, we felt we two need, incomings. Yeah, we felt we needed um, competition for Wheelie really, uh, if you do get an injury there, Matthew's a very capable keeper and, uh, and Aaron Rodriguez has got Quality. You saw that from the, uh, the, the cross for the first goal, for the, for the goal. Um, again, needs to get fitter, but I could say that about the whole team, second half.